we recognize that there are a lot of unsung heroes amongst us and we are intentionally trying to find ways to celebrate people. Um, our people work tirelessly um, every day to serve our youth and to serve our communities and so this is part of what will now become our culture in board meetings and that we will do a celebrating with Christy uh, one board meeting a month because some months we have two and some months we have one. On March 15, HUSD kicked off Wellness Week as a way to celebrate and support staff. Each day focused on a specific topic and shared resources related to wellness. Monday's focus was nutrition and our Nutrition Services Department provided some quick and easy meal recipes for staff to enjoy. On Tuesday, Val Velez, HUSD's Health Education Program Specialist, led the district through an exercise on mindfulness, and on Wednesday, our partners at Altura hosted a workshop all about financial literacy. On Thursday, West Valley's athletic trainer, Rashid Bardley, led a video workout. To wrap up the week, staff had the opportunity to pick up popcorn goodie bags to enjoy as they streamed two movies from their homes over the weekend. Next. Uh, would like to recognize uh, Shannon Vargas and Thomas Windmiller, two counselors from West Valley High School, were recognized by the College Board for their exemplary work with students. The College Board Counselor Recognition Program honors the innovative middle and high school counselors who go the extra mile to expand opportunities for students and who are seeing results. We are very grateful for the impactful work of Shannon and Thomas. Congratulations on this recognition. Next is a music night that was hosted at West Valley. Students at West Valley High virtually welcomed community members to a night of music featuring solo performances by the West Valley High School Band. This was an evening that was well attended and enjoyed by all those who participated. Next, as you know, our CTE fair has become a beloved event in our district, and we did not miss a beat even in the midst of COVID-19. So HUSD recently welcomed families to learn more about CTE pathways from students, instructors, and industry partners at the HUSD virtual CTE fair. Thank you to Hemet High's college and career counselor, Lauren Lloyd, and HUSD's principal coordinator of college and career, Laura Gallardo, for their time creating this year's virtual event. Next, we have our Teachers Our Heroes Award. Uh, Teacher Dee Phillips from Ramona Elementary School received the Teachers Our Heroes Award presented by KATY Radio Station in partnership with Azusa Pacific University. In order to be considered for this award, teachers must be nominated by parents and students for making a difference in the lives of their students. HUSD is proud to celebrate D for this special recognition. Next is the BEST Award, which is the Bilingual Educators Succeeding Together Administrator of the Year. And we are pleased to celebrate with you that Elisa King, Assistant Principal at Val Vista Elementary, has been chosen as the Riverside County Bilingual Educators Succeeding Together Administrator of the Year. Her dedication to our English learner students is an inspiration, and her advocacy for equitable programs to support student outcomes is truly appreciated. Next, a huge shout out to custodial services. So often uh, they work behind the scenes and don't get direct recognition for their hard and diligent work. And I'm just so pleased this evening to recognize our custodial services team. They have worked hard arranging classroom furniture, installing clear plastic barriers at all desks, ensuring cleaning and safety protocols are in place. They've also completed specialized training on the proper way to sanitize classrooms with misters, as well as training on how to administer rapid deployment in case of an emergency. Thank you to our custodial team for your flexibility in learning new protocols, establishing new systems, and helping to ensure the safety of all students and staff. And last, it's all about kids, and we're going to end on a note about our students and celebrate the recipients of the JROTC scholarship, Cadet Colonel uh, Kia Rose Palma, Hemet High School Air Force Junior Reserve Officer Training Corp., uh, Corp Commander was awarded the Air Force JROTC Leadership and Character Scholarship. Scholarship includes room, 
board and tuition for four years, valued at $100,000. Our goal is that all students will be college and career ready upon graduation, and so we are delighted uh, to share with you the success of our students, including those like Kia Rose. And so with that, um, thank you for celebrating along with us, and we look forward to next month and our opportunity to share again. So thank you all.